Good afternoon. Can you see me? Hello. Teacher. Hello. Good afternoon, everyone. Can you see teacher? Yes. Yes. Hi, Pepe and Pele. How are you today? <laughs> How are you today, Pepe and Pele? I'm good. You're good. I'm glad to know that you're good. Can you see my PowerPoint? Yes or no? Not. Can you see my PowerPoint? No. Are you sure? No. It's this one. Can you see it now? Yes. 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 Okay. Yeah. <laughs> How are you? What did you do today? What are your classes today? Hmm? I know. What? <laughs> did you learn grammar today? Yes. How about English? Did you learn English today? No. no. I am low English. You learned grammar with teacher Aldrin, right? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Let's wait yeah. for the... Uh, hi, Metat. Hi, Metat. Metat. <laughs> oh, pala, what is eating chocolate? Hi, Supawit. Hi, Supawit. Hello, teacher. How are you today? Supawit. Huh? Hi. Sherman is not here yet? No. I don't know. Supawit, you still remember our song? Yes or no? No. No more? Yay! Yes. Later, I will let you sing after class, okay? Yeah. Okay. Can you see me? Can you see? What? I cannot see you, Pepe. I feel like a Pele, sorry. Okay, good afternoon, everyone. Are you ready to learn? Are you ready to study for today? Yes or no? Yes. Yeah. I uh, say good afternoon, teacher April. Good afternoon, teacher April. Okay, good afternoon too. I hope you're having a good day. All right, let's yes. continue yes. our discussion last time. Last time we talked about materials, right? Yes or yes? Yes, yes, yes. We talk about materials, right? What are the two types of materials again? We have. Natural materials and man-made materials. Can you see it? Can you say it? Natural materials and man-made materials. Natural materials. And man-made materials. Man-made materials. Okay, those are the two types of materials all right and last time we did talk about uh natural materials we already done talking about natural materials right yes or no yes yes okay now let's review can you read it after teacher natural materials natural materials yeah oh sherman is here you're late <laughs> Okay, let's read all together. Natural materials are materials. Natural are material, natural. Naturally Pico. found on earth. Naturally found, found on earth. We can earth. get natural materials from plants. We can get natural, we can get natural materials uh -huh. from plants. Animals or the ground. Natural on the ground. Okay, that's natural materials. And we have here wood. We already talked about wood last time. Again, wood, we can get wood from 
trees. We can get wood from trees. And some examples of the objects made of wood are the table, the chair, pencil, ladder, fence, and many more. Understand? Yes or yes? Yes or oh no? No, no, no. Okay, next one. We also talk about rubber last time, right? Where can we get rubber again? Where can we get rubber? Rubber trees. Rubber trees. We can get rubber from rubber trees. Some example of the objects made out of rubber are rubber band, rubber ring, rubber boots, rubber eraser, balloon, and many more. All of those materials are made out of rubber. Again, we can get rubber from rubber trees. Next one, we also talk about cotton. Can you say cotton? Cotton. Oh, cotton. Okay, where do, where can we get cotton? We can get cotton from trees. Cotton trees and cotton plants. Some examples of the objects made out of cotton are clothes, blanket, rug, towels, and many more. Ma. Again, we can get cotton from cotton trees and cotton plants. Can you give me an example of cotton plants? Mm -hmm. ah, give me an example of cotton plants that we talked about last week. What are the different examples of cotton plants we talked about last week? We have rice. What else? That is straw. Ah. Oh, sorry, sorry. That's straw. I'm sorry, I forgot. Yeah, that's a straw. Yeah, again, cotton plants. Uh, cotton, we can get it from cotton plants and cotton trees. Cotton trees. Have you seen have you seen a cotton trees before? No. Not yet. How about a cotton plant? No. Oh no. Okay, next one. Let's proceed to straw. This is what I'm talking, talking about. Straw, we can get straw from cereal plants that have been dried. Some examples of straw are of the objects made out of straw are basket, bag, hammocks, furniture, and many more. Now, I will ask you, can you give me an example of cereal plants? Corn. Corn. What else? Wheat. Wheat. Very good. Millet. Okay. Good job. What else? Sneeze. Okay, wow, you remember it all, Sherman? Oats. Oats, very good. What else? Wheat. Wheat, all right. Those are examples of cereal plants. Again, we have rice, rye, barley, wheat, oats, millet, maize. Those are examples of cereal plants. And we can, and straw are made of those, understand? When a cereal plants get dried or have been dried, this this will become a straw. Okay, yes or yes? Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Okay. Now let's proceed to leather. Where can we get leather again? We can get leather. Let's read. We can get leather. Crocodile. Crocodile. Cows and. Uh ostriches okay oh, we can hi. get leather from the skin of those animal again we can get leather from crocodile cow and ostriches we have here some examples of the object made up of let made out of leather we have here leather bag say leather bag leather bag okay we also leather have bag. here leather gloves leather, leather gloves Okay, we also have leather belt. Leather belt. Leather belt. Okay, what are the things you observe about leather? What are the things you can say about leather? About the texture and the color. What do you think? What do you think about leather? Do you think leather it's jacket? Do you think a leather is expensive? Yes or no? Yes. Yes, it's expensive. They have a nice texture as well. They are original. That means when you have leather, it's... Okay, we also have here leather shoes. 
What else? We also have leather shorts. wallet. That's the wallet. wallet. Leather jacket. Leather jacket. Leather Who among jacket. you has a leather jacket? Leather jacket. Leather Who among you has a leather jacket, wallet. leather wallet, or leather shoes? This. My mom has. Oh, your mom, your mom and dad. They have leather bags and everything. Leather belt. I think you have leather belt, right? All of you, especially boys. Boys, you have leather belt, right? The one you use in your uniform. The one you use during school days. When you're wearing a uniform. Mm. That's that a leather? leather belt, right? I think so. You think so? <laughs> okay, again, those are the materials made out of leather. Again, we can get leather from the skin of an animal like crocodile, cows, and ostriches. Okay? Next one we have here, wool. Wool. Everybody say wool. 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 Okay. Wool. We can get wool from animals such as sheep, goats, and camels. Okay. We use wool when uh wool is commonly used for for making clothes for winter. Wool. Yeah. Just wool. like for example, we have here jacket. We also have beanie. Beanie. We also beanie. have scarf. Scarf. Okay. All scarf. of these are made out of wool. Again, wool. We can get wool from the animals wool. such as goat, sheep, and camels. Now, I have here a video. Do you want to watch it? Yeah. No? Why no? <laughs> Okay, this video will show this video this video yeah. will show you how we get wool from a sheep. How we get wool from a sheep. Ready? You wanna watch it or no? Watch or no? Nah? No. Nah. Why? Meta, do you wanna watch the video? Uh, let's watch it. Don't worry, it's just short. This will show how we can get wool to a sheep. Yep. Ow. Ow. Can you hear? Yes. Yes, yes. These are sheep. <laughs> Uh, video is playing up. That's how they get wool from a sheep. What do you think is he doing? He's what? He's doing what? Yes. He is shaving. Or shearing or shaving the skin of a sheep. Let's continue watching.
Okay, that's how they get wool from a sheep. They are she shearing or shaving the, the hair of the sheep, right? That's how they get wool from a sheep. Same with camels and goats, okay? A sheep needs shearing every, I think, once a year because if, if they will not shave or shear his or her hair, it will become so heavy, it will become difficult for them to move. That's why they have to shear the fur of a sheep, okay? And that's how they do it. All right. Now let's proceed to silk. Everybody say silk. Silk. Do you have yeah. any idea where we can get silk? Do you have any idea no, where we can get silk? Silk. 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 Okay, silk. Silk. silk comes silk. from the cocoons of silkworms. It has smooth and soft texture. Again, silk comes from silkworms. It comes from the cocoon silk. of silkworms. Silk. Understand? Silk. Yes or yes? yes? Pepe and Pele, what are you doing? You're not listening? What are you doing? Okay, next. Okay, we have here some objects made out of silk. Next. We have necktie. We next also time. have silk fabric. Silk fabric. And of course, we have silk dress. Silk dress. Do you know what a silk is? Yes. Do you have any idea what a silk is now? Okay. When you touch when you touch a necktie, it is so smooth, right? Yes or yes? Yeah. When you touch or feel a necktie, it is so smooth and soft, right? That means that necktie is made of silk, shaped with this silk fabric. I think many girls, many Thai girls have this one because Thai dresses are made, some of Thai dresses are made of silk. We also have here the silk dress. I have I have a silk clothes, which is I am, I do it. I am using it whenever I'm sleeping. The sleepwear, it is made of silk. Yeah. Okay, these are the objects made out of silk. Okay, now I have here a video. Do you want to watch it? How silk, how silk made. <clears throat> Do you want to watch it or let's just skip it? Watch it. Watch, okay. Anyway, it's just four minutes, I think. You must have seen that mom wears beautiful, soft and shiny saris on special occasions. Texture, the beauty, and the luster of the fabric grabs a lot of attention and appreciation. But what is this fabric exactly? Fabric but silk. Yes, we have come across this term several times. Let us now understand what silk is and how the fibers are obtained. Start with, can you tell us the source of silk fibers? Is it a plant or any animal? Animal. It's an animal. This small worm called a silkworm gives us... That's a silkworm. But how can we get threads from such tiny creatures? And how many threads can this little one give us? Let's get to know the complete process by understanding the silkworm's life cycle. To begin with, the first stage is where the eggs are laid by the female moth or leaves. Which plant leaves are preferred by the moth? It is the leaves of plants like mulberry which are preferred. So the egg stage is the first stage. The next stage is when the eggs develop into larvae. Larvae are forms that appear somewhat like this. Yes, the worm-like structures. The larvae grow in size by feeding themselves on the mulberry leaves. So the growth in these is gradual. The growth stages of these larvae are also given a scientific name. The stages are called instar. Instar means the phase between the two molting processes of the insect larva. 
So in this case, we can say the larvae grow into first instar, second instar, third instar, and so on till they feed themselves enough. Once the larvae are content with the amount of food consumed, that is, the case, they enter the next <coughs> stage. This stage is their resting phase. So for resting, all we need is a cozy cover around ourselves. Just like the blanket that we take while sleeping. Similarly, given these larvae, try to make a cover around them. This is when they secrete slimy thread-like structures from their mouth. They swirl their head in all directions when secreting the threads. As a result of this movement, a thick coat of threads gets formed around their complete body. This coat is called the cocoon. Did you know that this cocoon is what is of great interest to us? Because it is this structure that will give us the silk threads after we process it. Once the cocoon is formed, the larva inside it starts resting and enters the next stage of its life cycle called the pupa stage. The pupa stage is where the organism is sessile, which means it does not usually move and it starts developing the organs which adult moths have. So here, the pupa rests inside the cocoon and starts developing into an adult. After it develops completely, the next stage, that is the adult stage, is reached. The mature moth is now ready to break the cocoon and fly away. This is the complete life cycle of a silk worm. So now can you tell me how silk is obtained from these animals? The cocoon is the main source of silk threads. Once the pupa develops into an adult and flies away leaving the cocoon behind, the cocoons can be collected and the threads are obtained. The threads in a cocoon are extremely strong. They are surprisingly as strong as steel threads. The processing of these threads further gives us the silk fibers. In short, these are the four developmental stages of a silk worm's life cycle. The eggs come first, then the larval stage, followed by the pupil stage, and lastly, the adult stage, where the mature moths fly out of the cocoon. But how and where do we get these cocoons from? Do we have to go to the forests where the mulberry trees are? Is there any other way to get them? The silkworms are reared in special farms. Rearing of these silkworms is a profitable industry by itself. The practice of culturing silkworms is called sericulture. Next, we will see this beautiful practice of sericulture and understand how silk fibers are obtained from the cocoon. Okay, that's how silk fibers are obtained to a cocoon. All right. When the pupa comes out from the cocoon, they will collect the cocoon and they will, they will get the silk threads and they will make it as a silk fabric and many more, many more objects that made out of silk understand where can yeah. we get silk again we can get silk from where can we get silk again eggs. from cocoon cocoon okay cocoon of silk cocoon of what butterfly silk worms okay the, that is where we can get silk again silk from the comes from the cocoon of silk worms or from the cocoon of any other animals okay next one okay. let's proceed to clay everybody say clay clay do you have any idea what is a clay milo milo <laughs> do you have any idea what is a clay i have yeah what is it sherman it's a sticky thing and you bake it in the kiln. Wow. How do you know that? My no. Clay is made. Bricks is made from clay. Yeah, bricks is made from. He can do material. Uh, clay can make as pottery. Yeah, okay. We can get clay from the ground. We can use clay to make bricks. And bricks are building materials. Remember when you're in P2, clay is a type of soil, right? Yeah. Yeah, clay is a type of soil, a sticky, a super sticky soil, right? Yes or no? Yes. yes. 
Okay, now do you yes. have any idea how clay formed into a batteries or bricks? Do you have any idea how, how it is formed? Wow. Huh? Okay, we you use our hands. We use our hands. Yeah, okay. Now, can you give me an of what Chiro with? I can see your name from here. Don't write on the screen. Okay, can you give me an example of an object made out of clay? We have, what's this? Bricks. Bricks. How about this one? Bricks. Kitchen. 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 Utensil. Kitchen. 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 Utensils Kitchen. like, oh, what are these? Cups, plates, and oh. many more. And of course, we also have flower pots. Flower pots. Okay, these materials are made out of clay clay is a type of soil it is a super sticky soil and we can get it from the ground understand yes have you ever made a pottery made from no. clay? not no. yet oh we're supposed to do this one but unfortunately wow. we cannot because of covid no. we're supposed no. to make a pottery out of clay but we cannot do it anymore. Okay, I have here a video how clay is formed into a pottery and many more, but I think it's not necessary to watch. Do you want to watch it? Yes. Yeah. Oh, want to watch it? Okay. <laughs> this one is a soil. Soil. Oh, no. Yes. Wow. Now they wet it. They fill wow. it with water. They wet the soil for it to become a clay. Oh, no. Can you hold that one? Yes. Sherman, yes. do you think yes. it's disgusting? Yes. Yes. Well, that's one. They are adding water to break up the soil blocks into the mixture to make it fine, just like that. It looks like a chocolate, right? Wow, chocolate. Got a chocolate that says soil. Got a chocolate that says soil. Okay. Ooh, wow. Oh, wow. They let it settle for one day. They leave it like that for one day. So they will pour it again into a new pail. Water. Yeah, that's chocolate. That's chocolate. The hot chocolate is clay. The chocolate. Mm -hmm. Chocolate. Oh, wow. Now they put cloth there to seal, I think. Uh -huh. And they hang it on a tree so the water will come out from the shirt. Uh -huh. Oh, wow. Oh. And that's the clay. That's the clay. Tomorrow you will play a game. For today, discussion, purely discussion, tomorrow game. Okay? That's the clay. Okay. And they will now bake it. That's how they do it before, but today I think we already have a machine. We already have a machine used to bake the products made out of clay. Yeah. 
Okay, that's how they make they make clay. That's the process of making clay. Understand? Yes or yes? Where, yes. Where does clay came from? Where does yes. clay came from? Yes. Where does clay came from? Yes. Came from? It comes from the... Beautiful. It comes from the ground. Clay is a type of soil. It comes from the ground and it is a natural material. Understand? Understand? Yes. Okay, now, okay. I, mm -hmm, now okay. I will ask you. I want to test if you still remember our past lessons, okay? I will ask you. I will say objects. Mm -hmm. Quiet and listen to teacher. I will say objects and what are you going to do is tell me where it came from or where this object made of. Understand? Yes? Okay. Let's proceed. Let's proceed to the first one. Um, Pencil. Pencil is made out of... Pencil me is made out of wood. Wood. Very good. Next mm. one. How about flower pots? Flower pots. Flower Eight. pots are made out of clay. Very good. How about? <laughs> Eraser. Eraser. Eraser comes from or made out of? Eraser is made out of? Rubber. Rubber. How about shirt? Shirt. Cotton. Cotton. Okay. Where can we get rubber? Rubber trees. Only Sherman is answering me. How about Next one. Where can we get cotton? Cotton comes from cotton trees. Okay. Where can we get um clay? Clay. Where can we get clay? From the ground. From the, the ground. Soil. Very good. And they mix it with the water. Okay, good job. Next one. Mm -hmm. Where can we get straw? Cereal plants that have been dried. <laughs> wow, very good. Cereal plants that have been dried. Can you give me an example? I all the cereal plants. Huh? I can't remember all the cereal plants. Okay, can you say it to us? Corn, maize, millet, millet. Uh, I have one more. Uh, oat, rice, rye, barley. That's it. Okay, very good. I'm glad you still remember it. Can you give Sherman a clap? Give Sherman a clap because he remember everything. Give him a clap. No. <laughs> Why not? One, two, three. Three clap for Sherman. Okay, next one. Can you give me an object made out of... Rubber. Eraser. <laughs> Aside from eraser. Tire. Very good. Tire or wheel. Next. Now I will call a student. Wariela. Wariela. Give me an object made out of wood. Made out of wood. Table. Table. Can I answer this? We already answered. Next one. Pepe and Pele. I don't know. 
Pepe and Pele, give me an example of an object made out of clay. I don't know. Why you don't know? <laughs> oh, Pele. Pele. I know you know it, Pele. Give me an object made out of clay. Come on. Me. <laughs> oh, me. Who wants to help Pepe and Pele? Me, me. Oh, wait. Bricks. 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 Bricks can make us yes. a walkway. <laughs> okay, very good. How about Supawit? I want to hear Supawit. <laughs> Supawit, give me an example of an object made out of clay. Sherman said, Bricks. Sherman said, What else? Someone is copying me. I think someone is copying me. Who's that? Me, Tat Yang Yoon. Ometat, give me an example of an object made out of brick. A line. Come on. No. Asherman, help your best friend. Uh, flower pot. Flower pots, flower pots, potteries, and many more, right? Okay, those are examples of natural materials. Again, we talk about wood, rubber, what else? Cotton. Cotton, what else? Straw. Straw. Who a straw, what else? Leather. Leather, what else? Rubber. Rubber finish. What else? Clay. Huh? Clay. What else? That's all we learned. Wool. Silk. Oh, come on. <laughs> Silk. Not Teacher, cocoa. I know. Okay. I know what is glass made from. Where? Sand. No, you did an advanced reading. Mix with water. Are you sure? <laughs> we will figure it out for our next meeting. Those are natural materials. Now we still have one. We still have one natural material that we didn't talk up talk about yet, and it is metal. Now metal has a wide property. That's why tomorrow. We're going to talk about it like together with, the tree, with, with its no. properties. Yes, tomorrow we're going to talk no. about it, okay? For today, Neil. Neil, is of, Neil is made of metal. Yes, I know. Can, and tomorrow yeah, we're going to yeah, discuss it yeah. more further, okay? Now I want to play, I want to check your spelling skills. Hmm? I want to check your spelling ability. If you can spell the words, I will say. Okay? Are you ready? I I went to P three and I I have spelled United States of America. <laughs> it's all about science related. We're going to to spell science words, science related words. Okay? Ready? Ready? All right, the first one to spell me the word is method. Method, can you spell, spell me the word method? Metal? No, method. Metal or method? Metal. Method, I'm calling method. Method, can you spell me the word? It's wool. jogging time. <laughs> doing the wool. Wool. Meta, spell the word okay. wool. It's very easy. Very easy. Oh, yeah. It's very easy. Spell it to me. Wool. Easy, easy. <laughs> <laughs> wool. Ow. Wool. Oh, who wants to spell it? Who wants to spell me. wool? Me! Can you again? Me. I yes, I can answer every! Kautang. 
Spell me the word wool. Ah, uh -uh. let's just do this one. Do you have paper with you? Do you have a piece of paper and pencil with you? Yes or no? Yes or no? Now get a piece of paper and a pencil. Let's play spelling game. Okay, ready? Again, get a pencil and a paper. Let's play spelling game. I will say spelling. Yes. Huh? Spelling. No, no, we're not going to play. ดินโซมาวันนี้ไม่มีเวิร์ดวอลนะคะครับครับดินโซมาระดับปะปะโซไม่มีโซไม่มีโอเคเรดดี้อ่าเดอะเฟิร์สเวิร์ดเอ้
Number seven, crocodile. Crocodile. Finish? No. Okay, number eight is cocoon. 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 Finish? Finish? Finish. Number eight is silkworm. <laughs> silkworm. S I L K. Silkworm. S I L K. Oh, daddy is coaching. Okay. Yeah, okay. Silkworm. Oh, somebody is coaching. Yeah. O R M. Bad. Oh, suspicious. Someone is coaching. Who's that? Okay, ready for number nine? Okay, number nine. Ready? Number nine is silkworm. Oh, so we're number we're in number ten now? Yes. Okay. For number ten. Okay, for number 10, spell me the word leather jacket. Leather jacket. Leather jacket. Coaching. Yeah, someone's coaching who's done. I think. Let me see. Let me see. Okay. Okay. <laughs> uh, I've heard it? already. I heard. Oh, so Chanya should show my thing. <laughs> because I heard it. So Chanya, someone's teaching you, na? I think it's not sure. I can't see. <laughs> okay, finish. 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 Make yes. until 30. 30. Huh? What? 30. 30. Make until 30 questions. 30 30. words? That's too yes. much. That's too much. Finish. 15. Are you okay with 15? What? Words? 20, can? 15. Okay. 15. Okay. The next one we have fabric. 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 Daddy, don't teach now. I see. I see. Yeah, yeah, now I'm true. So, Chanya, don't show. Now I'm true. I heard it. I heard it. No. <laughs> Next, we have, okay. Next word we have um, cotton. 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 Finish. Cotton. Finish. No. Cotton. These yeah. are the words from our lesson earlier. Okay, next word we have necktie. Necktie. Buster. Oh, more writing on the wall. Huh? More writing on the wall. <laughs> okay, next one we have the word. Mm. 
shape. 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 Okay, finish? Yes. All right. And for the last word, we have science. Science. Science, 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 the subject. Finish. Okay, now I want you to keep that paper. Keep that paper with the spelling words and give oh, yeah. it to me soon, okay? I will give plus points. I will give chocolates to the person who will perfect that one, okay? No. Oh, oh, oh. Can you take it now? Huh? Can I see? Can I see? Can I see it? <clears throat> oh, anyway, you can send it to my line. Do you want to send it to my line? Take a photo of it and send it to my line. Is that yeah. okay? Oh, I will spell it now for you. No, we don't have enough time. <laughs> this is my line. You can send it to my line. Or just keep the paper. I will check it once you come back to school, okay? No. All right. It's time to say goodbye. We don't have enough time. Goodbye, Bye. everyone. Goodbye, everyone. Bye bye. 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 Bye bye.